Hey everybody, it's Heather Campbell here for Ellen Hudson and I'm back with another quick two minute tip video. For today's video, I'm gonna be sharing how you can use watercolors and salt to create a really cool backgrounds for your cards. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and prep my watercolors. Now I'm using the Avery L liquid watercolors for this and then I'm gonna prep my background. And the background to prep that, I just add water to my watercolor paper and get it ready to receive the watercolor. So as you can see, my technique for this is pretty easy. I'm just dabbing my uh, watercolor brush into that little spot of uh, watercolor, and then I'm just bringing it over to the paper. And you can see how it just disperses across the paper because that water is already there. So once I have my watercolor coverage exactly how I want it, then I'm ready for the next part of this technique, which is bringing on the salt. So to do this, I'm just gonna shake my salt right over the top of that wet watercolor and then I have to wait to let it dry. So once you're done, then you can just go ahead and brush the salt off of your paper and it'll come right off. And there you can see that background and how it's textured and really cool. Um, I think it's really fun for this technique. So I'm gonna go ahead and use the new Unicorns and Rainbows stamp set. And I'm gonna stamp some of these images out and these unicorns are just too cute. It, um, I cannot even stand it, they are so cute. So I'm gonna go ahead and stamp them out and color them in. And once I've got them colored in, I can die cut them out and then I'm ready to go ahead and assemble them onto my card. Now I'm just going to pop them up on some dimensional foam here. And then once I have everything set in place, I'm going to go ahead and add a sentiment. So the sentiment is from Pure Magic, which I think is super fun. And I just absolutely love these guys. So thank you so much for watching and have a great day. Bye.